Happy Arvo. Thank you for joining me here today on this special episode. It's Argo's 10th birthday, or at least it was uh, 32 years ago. We're celebrating it today by watching this a little Family Feud edition. I don't know what this is, but Michael sent this to me. Uh, thank you, Michael. <laughs> and sounds fun. He's my favorite little deranged Aussie Muppet. So this should be fun. Let's go. The quality is, it leaves a little bit to, to be desired, but on the other hand, it's kind of endearing. Beast. Like they're all pretty, we're all ugly. It's the clash of personalities. I'm something you can't O'Brien. A husband. It's family feuding. It's finals fever. Who will be the super celebrity? Okay. Excited. I'm getting excited. So you guys had an Australian family feud, huh? It's seven smash it double celebrity family That's feud cool. and celebrity wheel of fortune from 730. Wheel of fortune. I like how you guys say fortune. Fortune. Tonight. <laughs> what the heck? Nice to have you with us around Australia. We have, yes, two rather high-profile families playing the game tonight. And the first mm. of them is led by that adorable little... I can only imagine what Argo would say on Family Feud. Dirt Brian, here he is. And we're going to find out. Welcome. Yeah, look at him. Ten years old. I bet you do. Well, you can play this one with us now. <laughs> he looks like he's been in the dumpster for at least 20 years. All right. He's 10 years old today. Home before we start, of course, on your birthday. Well, who are that? That's his family? Birthday. I bet you got some very special birthday presents. What about that cute, lovable little Cabbage Patch doll they tell me was your favorite today? It wasn't a Cabbage Patch doll. It was a Savage Patch doll. It's <laughs> <laughs> dumb me to death. It stares at you. It doesn't blink. It's scary. Okay, this lovable, likable nature of yours, Argo. Where does it come I from? I think Argo's on something tonight. Come on, what's, uh, what's it's the family poison You know how to poison Emphasis on the poison? <laughs> well, we get the chance tonight, of course, to meet your family, don't we? Which yeah, is yeah, a I've bit of a bonus for all of Check us. And here they are. So away we go. Here's the <laughs> I love how clean cut his family is. Who's playing, Argo? Well, the one with the fake beard. Okay, uh, that's Starvation. <laughs> starvation? Elevation. She's a bit of a Elevation. <laughs> Doesn't blink though, and the one on the end, the one that doesn't look really real, that's Neville. Nevelation. Very, very welcome to our show. Aye. All right, we have Aye. a rather interesting family to oppose you here tonight. Yeah, I know. I chose them myself. <laughs> well, we'll make them welcome. Here they are, Fat Cat and Friends. <laughs> You guys know Five Nights at Freddy? Uh, I'm pretty sure that's who he's facing right here. These terrifying things. Is that who Argo is facing right here? It looks like it to me. Star, welcome. And this must be Penny Pelican. Yes. Penny Pelican. There they are, the opposing family. <laughs> Boo. They take on <laughs> aggravation. We've done the survey. Goodness knows where. I never knew his full name was aggravation. Oh my gosh. That's funny. But we, yes, we've surveyed 100 people and their top three answers up on the board. I mean, I guess I could have figured that out from the other people's names. Starve. Vation, et cetera. Okay, Agro, here's the question yeah, for you. Yeah, yeah, I love Away we go. <laughs> Name something you take on holidays with you. Uh, 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 Don't forget uh. the most obvious. <laughs> it's not that hard, dude. Toothbrush, Name suitcase. You take on holidays with you. Uh, 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 Don't forget uh, the most obvious answer. Shampoo. Usually gets the most points. Obvious, something obvious. Um, Your family. Oven mitt. Oven mitt. <laughs> oven mitt. <laughs> Are you sure of <laughs> You're taking an oven mill on yeah, the yeah, it's been the Let's way. try oh, it to the <laughs> <laughs> it's been the wheel. Oh, do we have an oven mitt? Yes! yes! <laughs> what? We do the survey. I bet Rigged. Is that where we picked up 100 people? Well, that's where I got the uh, opposing family. <laughs> we have, of course, three answers up there to reveal. If you get them all right, you're the champion. I'm already sad this is only six minutes. Champion family, so we yeah, need yeah, two we more. Know. We know, Question don't we, guys? Not no, something you no. take on holidays with you. Um, on holidays. Um, 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 sample? Sample? <laughs> well, you have the top response. Some... Some ball, some pull. Response with oven mitt. We'll try some oil. Here we go. I need is some oil on the board. Some oil. I don't even know what that is. 
I literally don't even know what sump oil is. A low sp a sump is a low space. Oh, like a like a um. Oh, a uh, pump. Undesirable liquids. What in the hell? Surprise! Surprise! There it was. Now, get this one, wow! Right? Shocking! It's there too. The to be fair, it was number three, right? It wasn't the oh. top one, so that seems legit. Yeah, everybody's taking some oil on holiday. Surprise! Surprise! There it was. Now, if you get this one right, it's three out of three. Of course, if you're the champs, you <laughs> play the major cinch. prize round. A cinch, you this think so? This is a cinch, yeah, this is Neville's answer. Let me tell you, Agro, if you get this one wrong, or if Neville Vation gets this one wrong, guess who can steal your points? Yeah, if he gets it wrong, guess who's getting unstitched? Aha, uh -huh. <laughs> there we go. Fat Cat and friends can pick up how many? 67 points on the steal. Ah, uh, no chance. So we're on the line here. You must get it right. Name something you take on holidays with you. Well, Neville reckons, um, luggage. Luggage. That no. sounds like a good answer. We'll yeah, try. Yeah, 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 yeah. If luggage is up there, the match goes right here to aggravation of here his it family. Comes. If here comes the match. to Fat Cat, do we have luggage? <laughs> no. So over we go. Fat Cat gives you a chance to steal the points. All right, in the huddle, you can ask the family. Now, Fat Cat, we must remind you, you can choose an answer from one of your friends, one of your family friends. kind of scary. Friends, or one of your own. You make the decision here. Then a question again, and this is for the match. Name something you take on holidays with you. Fat Cat says... Come on, Fat Cat, we need an answer. Fat Cat... Sewage. Oh. Fat Cat, you just had to say... <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! You can drive. I've never seen Agro so happy. Home after the show, Agro, oh, you you beauty! And congratulations! There we are, Agro Vaish and his family. At least when he wasn't groping his female co-host. The champions on this very special birthday edition of uh, Family Feud. Happy birthday, Agro! Thanks very much. No wonder I chose those dumbos over there, eh? Right? And we'll oh, take this break, folks. And we'll be back with more. <laughs> <just a moment. laughs> oh. <laughs> Steve Izard and Jennifer Kite join Agro next. Wow. There's a little bit more to this clip. Not sure. Oh, look at this. We got some like old Australian commercials. What do we got here? Oh, man. I miss the 90s. Oh, how many of you guys went to that? Coca Cola. Wow. Excellent. Uh, that was super fun. Agro never disappoints. And I think he was high on something during this recording. So that was very special. <laughs> Thank you for watching. I hope you're having a fantastic day down under. And I hope you join me here again tomorrow to watch some more Australian stuff. That's all I could say. Because I'll be here. Have a great day, guys. Goodbye.